AITA for telling my mom if she didn't want kids then she's not getting a huge Mother's Day celebration? Growing up, my dad stayed at home while my mom worked. While my mom financially provided for my sister and myself, she was emotionally hands-off. She came to a ballet recital here and there but didn't want to help with homework, didn't want to listen when we needed advice, etc. Our dad did 95% of the emotional labor. I later found out from my mom that my dad was the one who wanted kids. She loved her career and didn't mind providing financially but she did not want to do any of the stuff related to raising us outside of that. I am very grateful she provided for us financially, but I do admit it hurts that she wasn't there when we needed her. She was physically present but not emotionally present. Edit, as this has come up, to be clear, the arrangement was my mother's idea, not my father's. That being said, I do agree that my father was equally as selfish for making this arrangement. My dad always did grand gestures for her. Mother's Day was always a big deal with a huge brunch, flowers, gifts. She was spoiled. She did nothing for him on Father's Day. He had to do everything for himself until my sister and I were old enough to do stuff for him. I get that was the arrangement they had but I know it made my dad sad. I once asked why he didn't get the same hoopla our mom got and he just sadly said, Father's Day isn't as important as Mother's Day. As adults, my sister and I have tried to rectify it. We do Father's Day up big and our dad loves it. We grill for him just how he taught us and throw a huge barbecue with some other family members. However, we've turned Mother's Day very low-key. We still celebrate our mom but she usually gets a quiet lunch at a restaurant of her choice and a few gifts. After my mom ended up skipping my sister's baby shower this year because she didn't see the big deal with someone having a baby, my sister wanted to do nothing for her. We sent gifts but spent Mother's Day with each other, our husbands, and our own kids. My mom told us after Father's Day that she was hurt we didn't do more for her in recent years. I said that since she put in almost no emotional labor into raising us, we are putting none into her. She said that our father and I had an agreement. I pointed out that yes, but we never agreed to it and it won't fair that we grew up with an emotionally absent mother who didn't want us. And to be fair, we have had this conversation with our dad as well and he admits it wasn't fair to us either. I also said if she didn't want kids, then why should she be celebrated as a mom? My mom is upset with both of us and called us ungrateful brats. My dad feels bad for her but supports our choice. Ita. Edit. To those asking how I'd feel if my dad were the one that acted like this slash how I feel about dads who do this in general. They suck just as much and it's not fair to the kids, regardless of whatever agreement spouses come to. This is not gender specific. While some people may have a gender bias, I do not. 